How's it going everyone? DNC back in the Pokebox and in today's video we have a few special announcements. I'm going to get into the very first announcement. This announcement I've been very very excited to, to tell everybody and it has to do with these cards right here. Okay, so the reason I haven't been posting in a few weeks is because about three weeks ago now we got some very exciting news. Some news that me and Miss C have been very 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 excited about and we can't wait to tell everybody. Now we fish the can. Me and my wife are going to be parents. We will have a little Cora or Daniel. Now, my name is Daniel, obviously. But the way we're going to spell it will be that if it's a boy and then Cora if it's a girl. What do you think it'll be? Us, personally, we think we're going to have a little Cora. Guess we'll see. So that's one of the biggest things of why I haven't been filming lately. We've been trying to gather and group our heads around the fact that we're finally going to be parents. We've been together for 10 years. And now we finally get to start our journey as being a parent. We finally get to create and have our own little Pokemans. But, that's not all. So, obviously, you notice the cards in the background are not displayed. They're all over here to the side, and I'm going to explain that in a second. That's going to be the first thing. When I do start posting more Pokemon pack openings, which those are not going to stop, I'm still going to post Pokemon pack openings, pack battles, etc. Especially the booster box battles. I love doing the booster box battles. But, that's not all this channel is going to contain to no more. I'm going to start doing PSA send-offs so you can see me send off cards, see what they return. Because obviously if anybody knows too much about me, my goal is to have the ultimate Zapdos collection. All grades, 1 to 10, all cards. Obviously some of those will be easier to achieve than others. AKA Hidden Fates. <laughs> those, those are just everywhere, obviously. I have the most of those ones. So those are going to be the easiest. But that's not all we're going to do. We're going to also start doing Pokemon reviews. And what I mean by that is... We're going to review Pokemon, like, say, the very first Pokemon to the newest Pokemon. We're going to talk about that specific Pokemon. We'll make videos talking about the top 10 most powerful Pokemon, different things like that. I'm also going to incorporate gaming, you know, gaming videos. I love doing gaming videos, so we're going to have some Pokemon gaming videos. So this channel is going to be a lot different than how I started it. Of course, I told everybody that in the beginning. I'm not sure where we're going to go with it. We're just going to start and go from there. Now... These cards right here are going to be in the first PSA send-off, which is a lot. I know. But these ones are just kind of some of the main cards. These ones are cards I've pulled. This one I actually got pulled on um, Imposter Gary Oak's channel. This was my wife's first ever hollow, so I want to get it graded. This was given to me by Chase Ventura. And I just feel like getting these graded just because. Why not? Now, obviously, those are not all I'm going to grade. I have... All of these that I wanted to kind of showcase since no one ever really gets to see them in the background. So these are all of my Zapdos collection cards so far that we have to send off. Now we'll do an actual PSA send off video, which will include me going through all the cards, showing them off a little better, determining what we think the grades will be, and just kind of go from there. But, you know, just thought I'd kind of give you all a heads up what they look like since no one really gets to see all of my collection. Still, only have one of these. I need a lot more of those. Those are the, those are probably the hardest to get from Hidden Fates as far as the Zapdos is the Reverse Hollow. Obviously, I got three of the Rainbow Rares and only got one of these. Really, really low drop rates, I guess. But you know, I wanted to kind of let everybody know what's going on. I will be posting plenty, plenty of Pokemon opening videos. But I just wanted to let y'all know. Ooh, horrible card. That's probably a PSA one. Good thing I paid like 50 cents for it, huh? <laughs> but I just want to let y'all know so y'all have an idea what, why I'm not posting so much. Now, I'm going to start posting a lot, lot more here soon. It, it's not going to be just pack openings, though. I just wanted everybody to know so everybody's not like, uh, what, what happened? Did, did we miss something? You know? Just want to give you a heads up. Yeah, so I have a reverse hollow and a regular hollow of that one. Although this one's probably like PSA 4 or 5. It's really, really horrible condition. But, yeah. Hope everybody's having a good day. I know this ain't going to be the longest video in the world or anything. And it's not going to be the most exciting because I'm not opening any packs. But it is exciting for me because I get to finally share some news that I've been wanting to talk about for a while. And so I wanted you all to know that's why you'll see these in the background. Now, I'm not sure what we'll have, but our hopes are on either or. Really, I don't really care. But we're pretty sure we're going to have a girl. It's just the way it seems. Everybody's kind of content with that too. They all seem to think that we're going to have a girl. So, we'll see, I guess, right? But I just kind of want to let y'all know. I hope uh, hope y'all are excited for the, the new upcoming content because it's going to be different. I can actually take the time to edit videos and it won't just be like this, a one and shoot, boom. No editing, no nothing like that, which I do like. The pack battles and opening are going to remain like that. That's just the way I like to do Pokemon openings. There's not going to be none of this fancy editing or nothing like that. Now, for the 
Pokemon presentation videos and talking about a Pokemon. Let's say this one. <laughs> it's funny. I open it. It's Zapdos. So obviously I'm going to talk about my favorite Pokemon. We'll go through and explain the artist that first drew him. Explain his attacks. You know, it's different. I want to make something different. I'm not, I'm not going to do things exactly like other Pokemon tubers. Now I, I watch. I love informational YouTube, TikToks, etc. I love to sit there and learn things. I know other people do. But I also like to express knowledge and share knowledge with the world. So we're going to start doing that, you know. Be a little bit different. And plus, with the kid coming, I don't have all the money in the world, so I can't spend it all on opening Pokemon cards. So why not bring some different aspects to my channel so I can still enjoy uploading content on a regular basis and not have to go broke <laughs> just to do so. So... No, just wanted to give y'all a heads up. Now, I'm not going to premiere this video or live it. It's just going to be my first non-premiere video. It's just going to go up, and, you know, that's going to be that. Now, we'll go from there, you know. And obviously, if anybody wants a glitter name, go to my TikTok. My TikTok is... Here, I'll write it down. Give me one second. It'd be D underscore C 17. Both the D and the C are capital. I want to make sure I had it right because I don't want to send y'all down and you can't get your name done. But that's just if y'all want. You know, that's just something extra I do. Mainly it's for kids, honestly. But, you know, it's kind of cool, I guess. Something extra. I, I just like enjoy creating all kinds of content. I love doing art. So I'm probably going to do some art videos on here as well. Which those are probably really short videos. They'll probably be more of a compilation of the art coming to life on the paper and then revealing the final product. Yeah, we'll see. I don't know. I do all kinds of stuff. Speaking of art, if you're not following Third Eye on Instagram, make sure you do. He, he made these amazing art pieces. I call them art pieces. I know they're fingerboards, but these are fucking art. Sorry to drop the cuss word, but damn, they're art. You know, gotta, gotta be honest here. And if you want to make... He doesn't just do Pokemon. He can do pretty much any kind of art. You can, you can go check out his page. He's done plenty. Also want to shout out all of my mods. Normally I do this in the beginning, but I want to do this at the end this time. But... Thank you all. Pete the Pac-Man, Mother of Zards, Pep's Pokey Reveal, Chase Fontera, Pokey Cog, HD Pokey Hunters, JD Steet, CCM90, Pokey Lucky, Shiny Goggles, Alien Art, Mystic Mew, Demos Gaming and Things, Auto Metal Kicks, Psycho the Cardboard Gambler, Cory Story TM, My Pokemon, Pokey Beast, Pokey Drill, Darkhorn Productions, J Bob and Sons, Ben F Productions, MD Pokemon, and Bernie Shadows. Also, don't forget to go check out some other amazing content creators, TCC, the Card Economist. He does amazing lives every night as well. So, I guess we'll end it here, guys. More to come. We'll actually have plenty more content to share on here, including some pack battles coming up. We have a pack battle with JD State CCM90, and then me and Shiny Goggles, when I can get it, we're going to do a booster box battle, which would be me opening a booster box, him opening a booster box. We'll see who has the better pulls, etc., etc. We'll probably do it with a point system of some sort. I don't even know if we'll count reverse hollows or hollows. Probably just V's and up. That way it's a little more interesting. You know what I mean? But yeah, we'll, we'll go ahead and end it there, guys. I uh, hope you have a great day. We'll see you on the next one. I would say clean the mess, but it's kind of cleaned already. So that'll be it.